So here's some nice images from an MR enterography in a patient who with a known history of Crohn's disease. Now notice that there is clearly thickening and edema of the terminal ileum extending into the ileocecal valve, probably involving a roughly five or six centimeter segment. Notice also that on the post-contrast images, these le this segment of bowel demonstrates avid hyperenhancement. Now, Clearly, there is Crohn's involvement of the terminal ileum, but I think it's more important to note that on MR, you can nicely delineate active inflammation related to Crohn's disease from chronic stricturing or narrowing of the uh, terminal ileum. Now, in this case, even though there is thickening and hyperenhancement, notice that on the T2-weighted images, there is very little wall edema, so there's not much T2 hyperintensity, although there might be a little bit, and there's very little engorgement of the vasa recta or surrounding fat stranding in the uh, right lower quadrant mesentery. So this is a case where there is clearly some degree of a chronic component with perhaps only a mild degree of active acute inflammation.